Welcome to Communication for Happiness. Dr. Sushil and the cue card in hand is describe a stressful day at work and the cues are how was the day started and who else was involved and how did you cope with the situation. Cope with means deal. How did you deal with the situation? Every cue card has got three parts. I have mentioned it quite uh, often and here I'd like uh, to tell you again its beginning which is called background and its main part and its conclusion. When it comes to the background of this question, is like how you will start the question, it will go like this. Stress is an integral part of every work. When you have big goals, suddenly you will have big level of stress. You cannot uh, avoid it completely. But if you just give a twist to your mind, you can learn how to manage it if we how can how, how can how can you manage it deftly d e f t l y deftly means skillfully i am quite uh, good at uh, managing stress and here like describe a time when i had a very stressful situation at my office though i keep facing these things but uh, this is something unique which i like to mention over here Last month, everything was going quite well at office and uh, because it was uh, cold, so we were a bit free, everything was uh, conducive. C-O-N-D-U-S-I-V-E, -E. conducive means encouraging and we had some free time. I work with a company which deals in Shares. Shares means like uh, it's, it's it's a kind of share company which which help which helps people to buy and to buy and uh, uh, sell shares. And we have more than five hundred clients in the city. Suddenly, we got an email from the head office that. Uh, after two days, one of our seniors from the head office would come and he would deliver a lecture to the clients. And we had to arrange everything in two days, like booking a hotel and uh, arranging meal, arranging like uh, invitation and so on. As soon as my boss came to know about this, he got... Uh, you know, just flabbergasted, F L A W B E R G A S T E D. He got like, you know, heran ho gaya. Within no time, he conducted a meeting and he just told each and everything to the whole staff. And in a hurry, works were assigned to like employees. I was given the work to call all the clients personally and invite them to be at the place which was actually fixed before before calling them it was a hotel a very famous hotel in my, in my city and to call every client was a matter of three to four minutes 500 clients I started calling them 11 o'clock and I got free 8.30. It took these many hours and in between I was, I was not free. I just took 10 minutes out only for lunch. I had a kind of headache. But I, I didn't have any option. I couldn't help. Means like uh, what happened when I was about to leave? Like see something... Uh, else also took place which added fuel to the fire when I was uh, about to leave the office again we got a call from our head office that the meeting was cancelled and I had to give a back call again to the clients to tell them that it was cancelled for five minutes I was clueless 
I was completely baffled. B A double F double L E D baffled, confused. Then I used my mind and I just uh, <clears throat> something clicked to my mind. I had a list of those numbers. I sent messages to all clients that uh, due to some problem the meeting uh, would stand cancelled and that also took my one day half hours so that was quite stressful day at office which I can never forget so this is the answer of this question I'm Dr. Sushil from Communication for Happiness we did in IELTS PT study visa French and spoken English if you are in Panipat do visit us and subscribe our YouTube channel it's communication for happiness thank you very much